This is Kate Owens and I'm Nita Madaha and the work is a 14 minute hand drawn animation. Black dog, groggy black dog, down and down, shaggy black dog, where will you take me? The fact that it's called Me and the Black Dog references obviously ideas about the black dog and folklore as being this kind of dark presence. That sometimes she appears as, be as very much a child, sometimes she, come, she becomes much, much older, so she, she morphs and that was also a way of us holding on to the idea that when one experiences an attack of depression it, it, it kind of can come upon one. It's, it's, things are very kind of shapeless or shape-shifting. It is the idea about a mental health issue not being something that's taboo or something that one has to feel embarrassed about or, or consider as a problem that in essence when you have a mental health issue it can be it, it's an intrinsic part of your personality and that it, it is what makes you who you are. I'm going to pull the monster out from deep inside and wear it like a big fur coat. I'll wrap the dog skin around me. I'll be the black dog with teeth hovering over my head. So it's a four screen installation with the sound kind of panning from different screens. And we just basically wanted to create a kind of a very immersive experience for the audience. So different parts of the film will play on different screens at different times. It's taking the fragmentation that's there in the voiceover and in the visuals to another level through fragmenting the work onto different screens and through different, different speakers in the, in the installation space. Animation allows you to be able to explore quite, um, quite difficult themes in a way that becomes somehow more accessible it is one step removed from reality. You know, a lot of people's mental health problems can stem from childhood, and I think it engages with that sort of childish side to you. I think animation connects with that sort of maybe slightly wilder, creative, childish thing we have in us.